Hey guys, this is Nathan Mann, your host of Beards and Bows Outdoors. Today I just want to go over the cons of the Sun Dolphin American 12 Plastic John Boat. It's been a great boat. I had it all decked out. If you want to see where I deck it out, here's a video for that. If you want to see my new boat that I've got all decked out, here's a link for that. Also be down below in the description. If you're looking to get this boat, I want you to be aware of some things that I've learned after having this boat for a while. The pros over this boat, it's lightweight. It fits in the back of your truck. It gets in shallow water where most other boats can't get to. That's about it. <laughs> now the cons. Let me show you what cons I'm talking about. We'll go over to the boat and I'll show you what's going on. Let's get it. We're at the boat over here. I'm gonna show you what's up with this, why I'm gonna be getting rid of it, and also show you what I got now. Show you the new boat, in case you missed it. My main issue with this boat, there are no drains for each bay. See? These two will fill completely with water. This back here has your drain. This will drain out some. Also, these ridges in here will never drain. The water ends up turning green. You end up having to spray it out, clean it out. Also, these ribs are tough to walk on. I was thinking about putting some flooring in it, but I moved on to my other boat and I'm not looking back. These are hard to tread. These are hard to stand up, walk around, especially if they're wet. I just got done shop backing it out. It was a nasty mess. I had to scrub it all down. So now it's all cleaned up. Another thing I don't like about this boat, but you have your two holes down here. One is for your rear compartment up top. It drains out of there. And the other one is if you get rain inside the shell of the boat, inside the body of the boat, you could drain it that way. My issue is it doesn't drain like it should. It'll drain so far and then it'll still have water left over in there. So what I've ended up doing is drilling a hole right here. And once it's all drained, you tilt it all the way up and you tilt it to that corner, tons more water will still come out of that hole. So it's just a pain in the butt. I'm tired of having to flip it over, clean it out, scrub it out. Even with the cover, some water still gets in there and it's not fun. I was actually gonna drill a hole, run a tube in between two bilge pump ports. And that way that can at least drain to a certain level instead of getting completely full. It will twist and warp the body. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it kind of twists and warps the body a little bit. This is my new shallow water this is a 14 footer, 1973. I fully redid this boat inside out, paint, everything. Went AMC. I wrapped this 1973 Evan Root outboard. Still gotta do a little bit of touch up paint. I have a full build series on this boat. I'll leave a link up above and down below in the description from installing just about everything on here. I have a bass boat project in the works. Beards and bows out.